In this video, I'm going to show you real quick how to install shaders and Optifine for Minecraft 1.19. To get started installing Optifine with shaders for Minecraft 1.19, what you want to do is open up your Minecraft launcher, make sure to select the latest release 1.19, and we need to just play it once. So click play right here, and this will make sure Minecraft 1.19 is downloaded to your system. Once you've made it to the main menu, you can just click quit game. Now go over to the links down below in the description, which will take you to how to install Optifine and shaders for Minecraft. Well, it says 1.18.2 here, but you can now do this for 1.19.2 and this will probably already be updated once this video is uploaded. So all you gotta do here is scroll down to where it says download Optifine. This page will work for all versions just like that. And there it says 1.19 and because there are no full releases for 1.19, you have to click preview versions. In the future, you can just click mirror or download right here under Minecraft 1.19. All you gotta do here is click download or mirror Whichever one you click, it should take you to this page right here and then you just click this, close this tab because it will redirect to an ad. And there we go, we have Optifine. So if you take a look at Optifine right here, it should have this Java icon. If it does not have that Java icon, scroll down on this page to where you see Jarfix, click this, download the program and run it once. It may fix Java for you and if it says you don't have Java, then you need to download Java right here. Now you should all be able to open this installer, just click it. It will show you this installer and all you got to do is click install. And then it will say Optifine is successfully installed. You click OK and it will automatically close. Now it is already time to download the shaders you want to use. Now you can pick any shaders you want from this 1.19 or 1.19.1 list, but you can also just go over to the how to install Optifine page, go down all the way to the bottom where you'll find Silver's Enhanced Default, which is what I'm going to use for this video. Just click it right here. Then click download Silders Enhanced Default and I'm going to download Fancy for this one. This will take you to CurseForge, you click download right here and your download will automatically start within 5 seconds. And like I said, you can replace the shader with any one you want. There we go, we got the shaders. I'm going to drag this over to my desktop right here. And then all you got to do now if you're on Mac or Linux or whatever is go to your app data folder. So your .minecraft folder should be located somewhere in there. If you're on Windows, it's fairly simple. You press the Windows key and R and this will bring up the run window and you type in percent app data percent and hit OK. This will take you here to .minecraft. And then if you've never installed shaders before, right click somewhere in here, hover new, click folder and then enter shader packs lowercase. Open up your folder and drag in the shaders. So that's it. Close this window right here, open up the Minecraft launcher, make sure you select the Optifine profile that has newly been installed, just like that, and then click play. You'll get this little warning, just read what it says and if you do understand the risks, you take this little box and click play. And there we go, if we now go over to options, video settings, shaders, we can see that we can select Silver's Enhanced Default right here. And there we go, click done, done, done again. And if you now join a world, you can see the shaders in action. There you go, that's how you install Optifine and shaders for Minecraft 1.19. And that is how you install shaders and Optifine for Minecraft 1.19. Of course, like I said, you can replace the example shader that I used in this video with any other shader that you can download from shaderpacks.net. If you enjoyed this video and the tutorial work, be sure to give it a thumbs up to let YouTube know that other people should watch this video as well if they want to install shaders for 1.19. And then of course you can also subscribe because most of you guys watching are not subscribed to my channel yet. And then last but not least, I will of course, as always, catch you in the next one. See ya!